Hey, what's up, everybody? It is Monday afternoon. Got Monday Night Football tonight, week eight. Got a big slate of NBA games tonight as well. Gonna go ahead and combine my Monday Night Football and my NBA video today. I, let's see here. Let's check the records. NFL yesterday went four and four, but it was up. If I can find my notes. Yesterday went four and four, was up 1.25 units, um, hitting the big play Chargers for two units, and uh, hitting unit on the Eagles. The one big loser was Cardinals. I lost 1.1 units on against the Ravens. Thought they would cover, but they didn't. So, anyways, that puts the overall season record to 44 wins, 35 losses, which is 55.7 percent, and the units are currently. Let's see. They're around. I'll have them in the notes in this video, but it's around 3.4 units or 3.3 or so. So, anyways, oh, 3.34 units is how much up on the season when you add in all the wins and losses, all the juice. So, up a little bit. Um, hope to do better in the coming weeks. Tonight, I don't love it. We got. Um, Pittsburgh at home with their third string quarterback going against the Dolphins who are tanking hard as everyone knows. So Pittsburgh's at home. They're currently favored 14. 51% of the tickets on Miami, 66% of the cash on the Dolphins. Uh, the total's at 43 and a half. And you got approximately 57% of the tickets and money going with the under. So I'm going to stay away from the total. I'll put a half unit on my Dolphins plus 14. I don't love it, but um, I was annoyed that I had just done a lean on Thursday night and then had a winner with both the Redskins and the under. So anyway, half unit Dolphins plus 14 tonight. NBA, here's a big board as tempted to take a lot of games. Um, I'm just going to give out three plays, and then I'll give you my lanes. Uh, going with the Bulls again. I keep going with the Bulls, but they're playing at New York Knicks. I don't like the Knicks this year. Um, they've played decently so far. I think they were winning against the Celtics and then lost. And in game one, they were playing. They were up against... Uh, oh, I can't think of it. They were winning and lost again in game one. But anyways, um, I like the Bulls here in New York, favored by two. Uh, unit for the Bulls minus two and then moving down the list um Magic in Toronto Toronto's favored by five I'm going to take the Magic plus five for a unit um Raptors look good in their first couple games uh so did Magic I like Magic to keep it close I think the Raptors are a little bit overrated they did start out good but we'll see how they play from here on out and then lastly, I'm going to say half unit on the Jazz minus four and a half in Phoenix. Phoenix has played well. They beat the Kings badly at home, and then they were winning in, in Denver. Went into overtime, ended up losing, but played a good um, game that night. They come home the next night, very next night, and they beat the Clippers as a 10-point underdog. So they're playing well. They're 2-1, and one, could be 3-0, and oh. um, but they're at home. I think the Jazz are, uh, Jazz are coming off a loss and they're rested. I think that the Jazz match up well against the Suns. Um, DeAndre Ayton is still suspended, obviously. He's out for 25 games. So I like the Jazz and their big man to get it done here, minus four and a half. Half unit on that. So three games on NBA. Unit on the Magic plus five. Unit on the Bulls minus two. And half of a unit on... Um, the Jazz minus four and a half. I'd also lean with the Spurs minus six tonight at home against the Blazers. Blazers um, coming off an overtime win against Dallas. And I would lean with the Pelicans minus four and a half at home against the Warriors. Warriors have looked just so weak um, so far this year. They're getting blown up by everybody. So we'll see. Just leans on those and plays on those other three and then half unit on the dolphins tonight so good luck on whatever you play 
Um, Murray, if you're just watching the game, enjoy them. I will see you guys on Thursday with my NFL picks. Thanks and bye.